The Dewan Bahasa and Pustaka was one of several Merdeka buildings announced by the Yang Dipertuan Agong in 1963 as symbols of Malaysia's new independence and nationhood. In the 1955 general elections, the Alliance Party made an electoral promise to reinstate the Malay language as a national language. The Education Minister Tun Abdul Razak announced the establishment of the Balai Pustaka in 1956. It was later renamed Dewan Bahasa and Pustaka. The Dewan Bahasa and Pustaka building was designed by Lee Yun Tim, who also designed the Federal Hotel, Jinwoo Stadium, the Amno headquarters and several mosques. The building was officially opened in 1962 by the Agong. At that time, murals were popular features on buildings. The Dewan Bahasa and Pustaka mural design was worn by Ismail Mustam, who was just a Form 5 student at Victoria Institution. The five centre figures depict a Sikh, Indian, Malay, Chinese and Eurasian looking at an open book with a stylized down lonta. The rest of the mural projected multiracial engagements, commingling in religious, cultural, educational, agricultural, industrial and technological activities. The use of a common language serves as an enabler within the national space of Malaysia towards unity and development of a greater future even if the people's backgrounds were diverse. <laughs>